Taurus, welcome to Saturated in Love, where we dive deep into the vibration of love. Thank you, Holy Spirit, on behalf of Taurus, suns, moons, risings, and Venuses. If you're new, please click subscribe so you don't miss a video. If anybody's interested in a personal reading, you can schedule at the number 4love.info. Now that that's out of the way, Holy Spirit, thank you for your gift, for your guidance. This is for dear Taurus. Minor problems. Feeling alone, can't wait to join someone, missing someone, definitely feeling like nothing's happening without this person. Very lost without you feeling or energy for some in the collective. The major solution here, major arcana shuffle, would be the world and justice okay so you have two it says to uh, the spirit is saying to recognize what you do have okay don't focus on what you lack focus on all the things that you do have going for yourself mentally physically emotionally spiritually you might be alone but you are blessed on your own justice is gonna play out for you so you're just waiting for someone who is fair enough to join you on this journey you're a good soul, a good spirit. And Holy Spirit is not going to bring someone less than worthy for you. Also, if you're together with someone already but are waiting to tie the knot, it's not going to happen until it's for sure going to be a forever type of ordeal for you because that's what you deserve and held out for. Your present energy is that you do have options. Your person that you're most focused on, they are not starting a new beginning with you quick enough. And it seems like the relationship is growing weaker. Okay, so it might feel like you're being estranged from someone. Like you're both going in two different directions. Like you're questioning if they're still on board. You're also tired of waiting to see results here. The tower in the reverse. It looks like you're picking up the pieces and are ready to leave someone behind. What is this all about for dear Taurus? Already feeling alone, I, I sense. So like you, you feel like you can do battle by yourself. Paradise, happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other. You are missing out on paradise with someone. If you are together with them, you feel alone most times, okay? General reading again. And the options that you are left with, they don't leave you completely satisfied. So, dear Taurus, you're in a difficult place. You're like waiting for the one, the one. Many of you look at your old photos and are missing this one person in particular. I do sense a deep sense of longing and missing someone could be a cancer a pisces or a scorpio doesn't have to be but with this person on your heart and mind it's hard for you to see paradise in front of you in your present circumstance without them you're completely feeling lost but if you are single holy spirit what can they look forward to in the coming weeks if they are single and in this reading here if they do feel lonely, if they are missing one special individual. Spiritual growth. You spending time alone is going to empower you. It's not just here to leave you sad. It's here to teach you something and evolve you. You're also going to be able to travel, mental travel to a new space and a new place. Okay? I feel like the more you reminisce looking at old, old photos, it's like you teleporting back to a different time, okay? You might be able to connect to your twin souls if you believe in twin flames during this time in the coming weeks just by thinking of them since you're pining for them and missing them so much and travel is here, okay? So if you keep looking at these individuals, thinking of these individuals could be a mature woman. This could be you or whoever's on your mind, okay? But you will likely be able to travel to either physically see these individuals okay you're drawing them close to you because of how much you miss them energetically it's kind of like going out into the 
ethers into into the world into the universe okay and then energetically your person senses hey dear taurus is thinking of me missing me and that's how you guys connect time after time isn't it for many of you okay so i do feel like you guys are calling each other back in or at least this is your energy dear taurus don't be so sad don't feel like you're alone because you're not Again, this time apart is meant for spiritual growth. You will travel to communicate with these individuals, either, again, astrally, so mentally traveling to, to, to dreams with them or to actually bringing them towards you in the flesh. Don't be surprised if they communicate soon, okay? But what is the romance angel's advice? Yeah, attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Enjoy again this time for spiritual growth. Enjoy this time apart. This time to connect your other senses. Your telepathic awareness, okay? I'm telling you, the more and more you ponder these individuals, the more they're going to travel back into your life some way, shape, or form, okay? So that's what's happening for dear Taurus, Heart and soul oracle, Holy Spirit, how can you speak to the heart and soul of dear Taurus? What do you need them to know collectively? Anyone who is sad and missing someone attracting this individual back into their lives? What should they know? Should they be patient? Thank you, Holy Spirit. It says, are you feeling a little lost and confused, wondering which direction, if any, to take and questioning what is it that you really want from life? Perhaps it's time to consult your inner child. You know, the one you've kept locked away for ages, the one who holds the essence of the real you. Isn't it time to listen to your heart? Wow. So Spirit is just saying to you, if you feel lost and alone, look, it's time to choose your direction. Okay, get on this plane, choose the direction. For many of you, it's somewhere that you used to be is where you want to go back to, quite literally. Okay, you're attracted to that place and it's calling you. Consider your options. Spirit wants you to grow in this season of being alone and being independent and not being tied down yet and not having everything you desire in your relationships just yet because you have to learn the law of attraction. It's working for you in this season. What is the intention of anyone that it might be dealing with dear Taurus at this time? If you're talking to someone and you're in this reading, okay? What are their intentions? This is likely someone you've known for some time. They think of you fondly and they do wanna evolve with you, okay? They want this to go somewhere. But also, the Eight of Cups usually means like walking away from a present situation the way it is. So this theme of travel and even your person's energy evolving, okay? You and someone from your past are evolving into a new situation. Don't think that you're going to be alone forever. I feel like this was a big test to get you to see past each other. You know, find wholeness within yourself. Know that you are enough, all right? Be grounded, be centered, be whole on your own. This is how you attract that pure love. Thank you, Holy Spirit, on behalf of dear Taurus, lovers, oracle for dear Taurus before we part. Again, anyone interested in a personal reading can reach out at the number four, love.info. It says, look inside yourself. Examine what is causing you to feel this way. You see? Look inside yourself. There's something about being alone right now. What is causing you to feel like you need someone else, okay? You are attracting them regardless, nonetheless, so long as you keep your head up and keep your focus on them, okay? This mature woman, again, might mean something to you, but you're working your magic in this time, all right? Continue to think about what you want, who you want. You're attracting them to you. Your situations will evolve, Thank you, Holy Spirit, for dear Taurus. Dear Taurus, be blessed. Peace.